Every year, thousands of athletes across the state sell MTN Chevy raffle tickets for one of Special Olympics Montana's largest annual fundraisers. And when the organization releases the names of the top sellers, there's one name you can consistently find atop the list. On weekday mornings, you can find John Hargett taking the 738 inbound bus to downtown Great Falls. All the people downtown are really nice. They treat me with respect. When he arrives, he goes to work. When I'm downtown, uh -huh. saying hello and do what I do. You can hear the jingle of his medals. You can see the confidence in his stride. It's not about winning, it's about achieving your goal. John sold more tickets than anyone in the state five times and sold the winning truck ticket two years in a row. I think this, I'll take this one, John. All right. Everyone downtown knows John and they look out for him. And everybody loves John, you know. Truck mm -hmm. man, that's what they call him. And he's the bravest guy I know. Mm -hmm. yeah, he can stand up in public and give his speeches and go up to total strangers and yeah. Mm -hmm. John, uh, he, John's taught me a lot. And John loves them right back. Oh yeah, all the businesses brings me love, joy, seeing them with all happy faces, seeing them with all my gold medals, and they want to know what I do in the Special Olympics. But perhaps the people most inspired by John are the ones who've been there from the beginning. You know, uh, he has a seizure disorder that the children tend to digress developmentally and he started to do that and then it stopped. John has made so many leaps and bounds since he was little and when we were told that he may never talk and now look at him, he spreads the word everywhere. And it's a word that touches countless people in Great Falls and beyond. Where do, where do you think you'd be without special Olympics? Without friends. Friends, family, the coaches, Unified partners, volunteers, everyone in the community. If I didn't have friends, I wouldn't not be where I am right now. Tom Wiley, MTN Sports.